guys what's up um today well it was supposed to be last night but i passed out early last night um pretty much like half an hour after the movie i saw last night which is red one my second round of watching it even though i wanted to watch venom um but i was late for that movie but anyway i saw red one for the second time and I decided to buy the Moana uh, merchandise last night instead of buying it on Tuesday. And this video is a review of the Moana Nacho Bowl, which is something I have been super hyped for, for since the moment they have advertised it. And to let you know, it's exactly how they advertised it. Like, it's pretty much, it's, it's pretty cool. It even comes with instructions, so, <gasps> yeah. If it hadn't came with instructions, um, the employees would have been full on, have no idea how to put this on, uh, put this together well for starters it's a four piece um it's a four piece um put together boat um i mean like just take it apart well i can't take the whole thing apart because once the um paddle goes on you cannot take it off like i tried i don't want to risk breaking it so once it gets put on it's there but you can still like take off moana which she is amazing by the way she is amazing like the quality of her is i think is extremely cool she's like a real figure in my opinion they made her look amazing like if you really wanted to, you can literally just like buy this as a holiday gift for your kid. That's just like how much of a cool boat it is. And the sail comes off too. And it's actually easier if I open it and then it's easier to take off the boat. Um, that's if I even remember. I literally just closed this. That's kind of like, for me, the hardest part about it is to remember how to open it. There we go. That's how you open it. I believe it comes with the nacho tray. Where, you know, the nachos go here and the cheese goes there. It's technically a one piece, but I had to cut it in order to take it out of the box itself. So, yeah, once this goes, this... Once this is put here, you can't remove it. So in order to remove this, you have to cut it out. You have to cut it in order to get it out. So yeah, anyway, you can remove the sail. You just have to pull it off. See, you just have to pull it off. And in my opinion, I it was very easy to wash. Um, you just gotta let it dry. Uh, I can finally get rid of these. I just washed them to show you. It's very easy to wash. You just gotta let it dry. And if you, and if you want to, like, you can just also just paper towel dry it. But I suggest you just let it dry on its own. Because, you know, water just leaks out of here when it, like, dri dries. Like it still is. <laughs> but. Like I said. It's. It's a pretty cool boat. It's a pretty cool nacho boat. Comes with instructions. So if you ever have. If you ever need like. Help just trying to put it back together. Then. Um, there's the instructions for it. And the fact that Moana has like holes in her feet to just put it on this bowl, I think you could do it, um, do it for pretty much anything then. Like 
for her for any place that you may have that you know she can just stick on so that even makes it any cooler if you just want to buy this for your kid to play with and if that's the case then the price is worth it then i got it for like 35 same thing with the popcorn bucket but i'm doing that popcorn bucket review in a separate video because that there's some complications which i believe that the bucket in my opinion you might want to get it as like a collection or even give it to your kid to play with or just use it as something else i will explain in a separate video but this in particular is for the nacho bow i need to get this back in okay here we go I literally had this in. <laughs> but anyway, this one's easy to wash. Oh, um, wash. I know I have this in, right? <laughs> anyway, I'll fix that. Yeah, once this paddle's in, you can't get it off. So don't even try to take it off. <laughs> Don't even try it because I tried and I do not want to break this. This was like, this was 35 bucks. And I'm pretty sure anyone who tries to sell it on eBay will do it a lot more. So if you see your chance, I suggest you try to try to. Not just for like nachos, but just, you know, if you want to like, I don't know give it to your kid as a gift or i don't know for like you know give it to your kid for a toy or something you should just do it because honestly it does look like a toy doesn't it yeah definitely does i might use it again on tuesday when i go see moana but instead of nachos <laughs> i might use it for m&ms Okay, remember how to open this. Come on, remember how to open this. Hey, I got it. Because, well, that looks bigger enough for a whole pack of M's, don't you think? Yeah. And the fact that I broke, I had to cut this out, so... It wasn't that hard to wash the cheese off because the fact that it was in this, and like here... And so it only got messy on the paddle sticks. So I basically just cut the nacho container and I swashed the cheese off the paddle. So it didn't really get messy at all. For those who are wondering how messy it got, and the nachos were in here. So it wasn't that hard to wash. But like I said, the bucket, that's a separate video because that. That's something that really needs to be discussed as a review. But yeah, it came with instructions. And if you buy it, but you never get a chance to get the instructions, I will, like, post, like, a picture of it. So if you get it and you never got a hold of the instructions, you can just look it up and they'll be right here for you. It's pretty like it's pretty simple but like i said once this gets put in it's impossible to take off i will have to say my favorite part about this is not only this but also the moana figure it's epic i think they did an amazing job with this one amazing <clears throat> So yeah, the bucket, I'm doing a separate video, and I will probably do it at my sink for many reasons. So, if you're curious about the bucket and why it has to be separate and other reasons like that, please stay tuned for that. But I would have to say these Moana merchandise, I think 
if your kid like loves Moana, I believe that these would be like good kid um good like toy gifts for them. As you can see, it's a boat. And you know, if they like putting toys into things, you can obviously stick a toy inside. <laughs> Uh, here I go again. <laughs> you can obviously stick toys in it or something like that. So, yes, I think this would be a good gift for your kids. So, definitely more than one good use for it. More than just nachos. There's definitely multiple good uses for it. Instead of, you know, being nachos or just sitting on the shelf or something. Definitely multiple good uses <laughs> <coughs> i can't say which like bucket or something is my favorite so far but when it comes to a nacho tray this is my absolute favorite <laughs> i just wish i enjoyed the nachos <laughs> i don't know something happened last night that caused me caused me to be so nauseous and have a like a uh, let's just say something happened last night and I guess it was like I'm not I don't know I've been having so many medical problems that food it's been interfering whenever I had food so and last night it interfered with watching the movie but luckily I didn't luckily I didn't need to go home so thank goodness because uh, even though I already saw red one I I wanted to see it again honestly I did want to see that movie again, so thank goodness. I will talk about I'll talk more about that movie um later when I have the chance. But this was this is a review about this bowl which I love. It's my favorite nacho thing so far, because well for starters it's not popcorn, and this is the best. It's an awesome figure, honestly. And yes. I think it would be a great gift for your kids. Curious about if you're curious about price, it is thirty five. Same thing with the bucket, but when it comes to this in particular, it is worth the money. I'll explain about the bucket later. So, hope you guys have a good day or night. Or so far, it's still the morning. So. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.